name is Joe here. I just want to quickly show you how to purchase a domain name and forward a domain name on GoDaddy. So first of all what you want to do is go to www.godaddy.com and at the top here once you've chosen your the name that you'd like to purchase just put it in the box here for example joepeters.com now you can also instead of .com you can have .info, .net, .org, .tv or .biz or any of those other ones .com is obviously the most popular but I quite like .info and they do only cost $1.99 um, so for this example I'm just going to show you .info because I know .com is already gone so then click go and it should tell you if your domain name is available or not so we'll just see ok in this case it is available here if it comes up and says it's not available you just have to keep trying different domain names till you find one that's available and that you like so once you've found it you can choose which one you want I want .info which is ticked already so then come down and proceed to check out and don't worry about any of that just press continue and then you'll have to just create a um, account here with GoDaddy just to fill out all your information your address and so on and just click continue and follow the instructions and then they'll email you with your account details which be, will be a number just like this one here that is the number that you will log in with and you will have chosen a password so um, once you've done that you've created your account and purchased your domain name then you'll go back to the home page and I'll show you how to forward and mask a domain name so what you want to do is you'll want to come across here to the tab that says domains come down to my domains click on that And as you can see, I've got three domains with this company here, and I'll show you how to forward by just tick tick the domain name that you want to forward. So I'll just tick that little box there, and you'll see that it's highlighted these keys along the top here. Now you want to select the green arrow that says forward, and it comes up managing manage domain forwarding. So click on that. bring this box up that says forwarding forwarding and mask domain now in the forwarding tab you just want to tick enable forwarding and then put in your um, URL that your company gave you which is personal to you with your username or numbers on the end there and don't forget to put in the HTTP at the beginning so type that in and then tick the move permanently button and press OK and then that will go into a processing stage now that can take anywhere from a few minutes to a few hours just depending on how busy the server is so you just have to um, click back and see if that's processed OK because once it's processed you'll then want to come back to the click on the forward button again and then it'll open this box but then click onto the masking tab and I want you to click enable masking and the reason that I want you to do this is because the whole point of masking is what happens is when someone say clicks on joe um, earnyourworth.com 
when they've gone to the site it, w it will say earnyourworth.com still it won't redirect and come up with your um, URL that you're with your numbers and username on the end it'll just say earnyourworth.com the whole time now if you're going to use Google or AdWords then you have to make sure that you've got masking on your domain as Google does not like redirected domains so you will definitely want to do this so yeah just tick the enable masking box and then you'll just want to put a title here now this is the title that will show up on your browser when they get to the website for example on here it just says domain manager home that's that's their title so that's what would be there um, you can you can make it say work from home or make money now or just have it as your your website name is what I've done here so once you've got a title don't worry about these other boxes just click OK and again that will go into processing mode and once that's done then you'll be able to start driving traffic to your um, own domain name which will then forward to your um, business website alrighty and that's all there is to it so I hope that's been of help to you and we'll chat again soon